how are we all doing today? Uh, I'm excited to review another great read published by Packet Books. It's uh, Modern Computer Architecture and Organizations by Jim Leiden. Um, Jim Leiden, I believe that's how it's spelt right there. Um, this is a whopper of a book. It's filled with a ton of low level technical details about all sorts of different architectures. Um, so that's exciting. Um, we get to explore everything from earlier x86 systems up to the newest 64-bit systems um, covering things like ARM and RISC-V architectures which you know include everything from our use of everyday devices like their smartphones we use or laptops also includes things such as virtualization um, and you know larger scale systems as well um, so this book, Modern Computer Architecture and Organization, it begins with a gentle introduction um, into the pretty complex field, which helps us to build our understanding and knowledge of the concepts and key terms. Um, so these will, will be what we need throughout the rest of the book to kind of understand what's going on. Um, it goes over the history of computing devices, and it takes us really on a journey into like digital logic, which is fun, um, covering the details basically like how transistors and resistors can be used to build up uh, a few main logic gates um, from which more complex and robust designs can then be built um, really it has you know covers of like the and or inverters which are like the main primary ones and then it gets into like latches and flip-flops and adders and registers um, these are all things which are pretty much key in understanding how our computers store and retrieve data today so um, very important uh, this book is broken up into three sections um, you know section one is the fundamentals of computer architecture section two is processor architectures and instruction sets and section three is applications of computer architecture um, so it's a good divide and breaks up the book nicely um, I personally learned a ton of new stuff especially about like security and how it's handled within the different architectures um, as well as the performance enhancing techniques used to make our digital devices faster um, it covered in depth the use of like the different levels of caches and how they're used today and how they play such an important role uh, in modern efficient systems so that was that was exciting to learn about um, there are also plenty of examples of each of the important architectures uh, including how each one uses assembly language to communicate with the processor, so that's exciting too. Um, as well, there's exercises at the end of each chapter, so go through a chapter, then you have exercises at the end, um, which really helps you to reinforce everything you've been learning. What's great about this book is there's an answer key right there for you, so like when you get stuck and you're like, Ugh, what, what do I do? You could just kind of cheat and go to the answer key which you're still learning so I mean honestly that's how I <laughs> finished most of the problems is because is I get stuck and I just look at the answers so now I know the answers so it's it's still a great process for learning um, so this book is basically like a great general overview of a pretty extensive and challenging topic uh, so it's not really like an instruction manual. It's, it's not going to show you how to build these different architectures from like the ground up or anything like that. Uh, but what it does is it gives you a bit of the history on each and shows you how everything um, today has basically grown into the current state that we are in. Um, so, so that's nice. Uh, it is a fun read and it's filled with plenty of interesting tidbits of knowledge that will help anyone planning to become a computer architect gain a strong foundation of core wisdom which can easily, easily be expanded upon and used later while taking classes or courses on more advanced topics within the field. Um, so this book I would consider is for basically all levels. It can easily be followed by anyone um, interested in this topic. So um, if you're interested I definitely highly recommend you give it a read because it will not disappoint you. Um, so to say thank you to Jim Jim Leiden Jim Leiden I believe uh, for this wonderful book, Modern Computer Architecture and Organization. As well, thank you to Packet Books for publishing another wonderful book. And if you think you're interested, I'd say definitely check it out and get your copy today. Thanks.